guys welcome to my youtube channel let's jump pharmacy today i'm here <coughs> to discuss about the biochemistry very important questions and also important points that what you have to write in your examination of biochemistry watch this video until last and share this video with your friends as much as possible one of the very important subject that is biochemistry Okay, many will think that this subject is very tricky, very confusing, very complex. See, you tell me one thing. Is there anything that is complex greater than human being? No. You are more complex than any other. So, according to the comparison, you are more complex. Yes or not? It is better to understand you means you are complex we can easily understand one human being but why we are not understanding this biochemistry because no interest first you generate the interest okay don't worry you start from today first try to generate the interest how the interest will comes the interest will comes by understanding the topic this is very important okay you have to understand the topic the basic topics you have to understand search in the google web search is there everything is in our hand only you have to search it and write down one side practice by writing as much as possible yeah yes uh, now let's start uh, the first question here say describe urea cycle and explain the general reaction of the amino acid simple one here first you define what is this urea cycle then you go for the steps of the urea cycle okay steps you know and here molecular formula is mandatory in 10 marks okay you have to write the molecular formula but if you don't know one or two molecular formula in between at that time you can write just a names okay one or two then significance you have to write energetics general reactions for any cycle significance is very important general reactions is very important okay and also the in energetics is very important next explain the biosynthesis of the proteins here first to define protein rna types of rna biosynthesis of the protein significance of the protein and also uh, some of the diseases which is caused by the protein kwashiorkor disease okay, or any other type of the protein deficient disease that you have to write down okay some or uh, four to five lines you have to maintain explain glycolysis and its energetics simple question define glycolysis you have to write five to seven lines about the glycolysis and all you have to write steps significance you have to go for energetics and all fourth one describe the beta oxidation of palmitic acid along with energetics beta oxidation of palmitic acid it is also called as a de novo biosynthesis of the fatty acids fatty acids or palmitic acid both are same if they ask first you write lipid what is this lipids give example then you write the steps of this beta oxidation go for energetics of that you go for importance okay and all enough then uh, tca cycle and give it significance define tca it is also called as uh, you write what is this all it is also called uh, carboxyl it is also called as a citric acid cycle krebs cycle and all steps you write energetics you write importance also you write and where this cycle takes place that is that comes under the examples in respiratory system in urinary system okay this all you have to write down now let's move towards the five marks a very important uh, questions of biochemistry first one formation of ketone bodies in the human body first define ketone bodies you go and write the examples of that ketone bodies means three types of ketone bodies will form no that you have to write acetone that all then steps you have to write with molecular formula in importance see in five mark molecular formula you have to write same here also if you don't know one or two molecular formulas then you can there you can maintain the names but maximum try to write molecular formula and in between that molecular formula you have to maintain the enzymes which enzymes are used and enzymes should not be written in molecular formula you can just directly write the name of the enzymes okay yes directly write the name of the enzymes hmm yeah explain the various types of glycogen storage disease here see sometimes they will ask Uh, write a note on glycogen storage disease or sometime they will ask write a note on lipid disorders write a note on amino acid metabolism disorders write a note on jaundice 
okay sometimes what they will do they will ask this type glycogen storage disease same first you have to define your glycogen storage examples you have to give explain any two in explanation what you have to write same how you wrote the pathophysiology you know same here explain for an example you ask lipid metabolism disorder you write which are the types of the lipid metabolism disorders you write that hyperlipidemia you can write what is that you define you write the causes of, by that means main causes what is the cause then you write the symptoms of that disease simple this you maintain na glycogen storage disease diabetes mellitus you can write you write what is the diabetes mellitus you write the symptoms you write the causes if you want to write you can write treatment also simple competitive inhibition enzymes you have to define types of inhibition competitive inhibition then you go for the again in competitive there are two types irreversible and irreversible with examples is mandatory here clear yes define genetic code and its silent features genetic code you have to define different types of codes are there you write down that and you have to write significance importance silent features these all are same classification of amino acids carbohydrates lipids and proteins from this one is fixed they will ask see amino acids same i will take one example of the carbohydrates if they ask carbohydrate means you define that one you write the examples then you write the classification significance you write and diseases caused by this carbohydrates if excess of carbohydrates which disease okay if less amount of carbohydrates no adequate amount of carbohydrates for the human body then which disease that you write then explain the structure of trna and its function define rna types explain trna with structure and also importance you have to maintain seventh one define gluconeogenesis simple here first you have to explain what is this gluconeogenesis steps you write examples you write significance you write for cycles these everything you have to maintain then coenzymes different type of coenzyme okay you know that if they be, they are ask fad nmda cyclic amp same you have to write you have to write the coenzymes only you have to define the coenzymes then you explain any one what they ask here if they ask define coenzymes means you have to write the coenzymes examples types okay then you can explain any two with structure just you have to write the fad full form of that then uh, you have to write the silent features or significance nmda full form structure significance okay atp full form structure significance this all explain the semi conservative mode of replication of dna define steps steps means one that uh, what do you call that three dna strands are there okay mother dna strands parent original type these all three strands you have to mention and you have to write down on that then describe the hormonal regulation of blood glucose level you will get everything in the notes okay so you can whatsapp me for the notes you can get everything in the notes define hormonal level significance and disease this all explain the significance reactions of hmp shunt pathway it is also called as 5 pentose phosphate pathway okay define a steps a significance then iub classification see enzyme you have to write first then you have to classify then you go for each with two examples at last you write the significance double helical structure of dna define structure of this dna go for the significance 14th one substrate level phosphorylation oxidative phosphorylation here also in substrate level phosphorylation you have to define write the mechanism of that role of substrate level phosphorylation in aerobic respiration then you go for oxidative phosphorylation uh, particularly explain in the mitochondria role of that uh, oxidative phosphorylation okay sometime they will ask separate write a note on substrate level phosphorylation or they will ask write on oxidative phosphorylation at that time you can write an electron transport chain you have to define this electron transport chain then you go for the types are there complex one complex two complex three complex four with figure and significance importance of this and where actually this electron transport chain will form if you don't know anything means at least you can write it takes place in the respiration it takes place in the regulation of the body temperature this all basic thing you have to write down biosynthesis of the purine nucleotides actually this question may be asked in 10 marks okay high chance of asking in 10 marks but why i keep kept this in 5 marks means uh, you can write down at least 5 marks 
pattern if they ask in 10 marks also you can capable to write down at least to get at least 5 marks define steps of significance you write down this one okay if you don't know anything means you define prote purines what is this pyrimidines you define write the example so write as much as possible what structures you know you write the if you don't know means just you write the names enzymes are very important enzyme structure is not essential here these are the 16 5 marks and 5 10 mark question very important two marks questions you will get in the notes which is sufficient for your examinations so if you want you can whatsapp me down in the description my whatsapp number is there okay for the notes yeah if you like this video so please try to share this video sharing the video like you are helping uh your friend why because means uh, everyone they know the answer but they don't know what to write so they can get some little some little bit of knowledge that how can write the biochemistry okay thank you